to cancel the nuisance audible arm you are required to input then press ok or the enter key Hello everyone, this is Jotech Electrical Contractors Limited YouTube channel where we learn through practicals. If you are there and you haven't subscribed to our channel, kindly, kindly support us by subscribing and remember to put a notification bell so that whenever we upload a video like this one, you can be among the first to watch this is a channel where we show different ways of how to troubleshoot kplc prepaid energy meters and more regarding electrical and electronic engineering if you are a returning subscriber we say thank you for your patronage Without further ado, allow me to introduce you to a very interesting video for today and we are going to look how to use short codes for a model KPLC prepaid energy meter Yoshen 2021 and 2023 I repeat, we are going to look how use short codes for a KPLC prepaid energy meter model Yoshen 2021 and 2023. Uh, if you have not watched our video on how to activate this kind of model Yoshen, yeah, the link is below. Go watch how to activate the ocean prepaid energy meter so what is a short code yeah what is a short code if you are currently using uh, this model ocean uh, 2021 or 2023 kplc energy meter you got a CIU and there is something called MCU. MCU is always installed inside utility meter box. However, for the CIU or the UIU, they are installed inside the customer's house or somewhere a customer will be able to access this part of the meter. What is a CIU or what is a, a UIU? This is a short uh, name for the customer interface unit, CIU. UIU is the same, which means user interface unit. Okay. So a CIU uh, is a part of the meter where a customer is required to input some shortcuts while he or she is inquiring some information okay the meter is designed with an interface for plc communication whereby the ciu and mcu are all paired all configured to start working together okay if a customer would like to inquire some information from the ciu he or she is required to put some short codes which are three digit code a customer will also use the CIU 
while loading the token which is a 20 digit number or 20 digit okay A user can input 20 digit token or a 3 digit shortcode and then press the enter key to query relevant data from the CIU. So whatever, whatever you see from your CIU is what your MCU is communicating with the CIU. So you can use multiple CIUs with one meter or one MCU whereby you are required to pair or to configure. Before we dive into shortcodes, I would like you to understand that if you are using this model of the meter, if you check your CIU just uh, below the LCD screen, you can be able to see somewhere written status 1, status 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. It is written S1, S2, up to S6. So, S1 means what? S2 means what? Up to S6. S1's display means reserved. S2 display means terminal cover is opened s3 display means bypass s4 display means the terminal cover detection forbidden uh, all installation mode s5 display means reserved and s6 display means overload okay so without further ado let's dive in to shortcuts like i have said you'll be able to query any relevant data from the mcu by use of ciu which is customer interface unit and here we go to check your credit balance you are required to input 004 then press enter key all okay to check the current time you are required to input 006 then press okay on enter key to check the current you are required to input 008 to check the current date you are required to input 005 to check the voltage you are required to input 007 to check the meter status you are required to input 009 then press ok or the enter key okay to check or rather to cancel the audible alarm you are required to input 0 nine five i repeat to cancel the nuisance audible arm you are required to input zero nine five then press ok or the enter key to check total active energy consumption of current month you are required to input zero one nine and then to check the total active energy consumed in the last day you are required to input 404 then press ok or the enter key to check the maximum power threshold you are required to input 307 right to check the total active power you are required to input 0 one one well those are the most important short codes i used ocean model okay however there is a lot of short codes for 
this model one can use so that's all for today and i would like to say thank you for watching our video and don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel